Developing news tonight, a former Somerville police officer is facing a murder charge following a fight that broke out last month. The South Carolina Law Enforcement Division, or SLED, charged Anthony Delestro today. On March 20th, a fight broke out between Delestro and 39-year-old Michael O'Neill in the parking lot of the North Main Street Chick-fil-A in Somerville. According to the affidavit, eyewitnesses said Delestro was the aggressor during the incident. At some point, Delestro told O'Neill that he was under arrest. The eyewitnesses also say the victim disengaged and said he wanted to leave getting into his vehicle. But Delestro entered the passenger door with his gun drawn and shot O'Neill, killing him. Tonight, Delestro appeared before a magistrate judge in bond court. And just any mercy you can show me where I could be with them and help them get through this, I would appreciate. My entire life was public service. I never did anything wrong. I never had one substantiated complaint in the 35 years I've been in law enforcement. And I just uh, ask you for mercy so I can help my wife with the girls. Michael O'Neill's family released a statement following today's news of Delestro's arrest that reads in part, quote, we appreciate the continued outreach, support, and respect for privacy during this difficult time. As we continue to mourn our loss, we are hopeful that justice will prevail. We appreciate the work and dedication of the involved departments who have worked to get to this point, end quote. A magistrate judge cannot set bond on a murder charge, so Delestro will have a circuit bond appearance at a later date in circuit court. And tomorrow at 2 p.m., Somerville's police chief, Doug Wright, will hold a news conference regarding former officer Delestro. You can count on News 2 for coverage as well as any updates regarding this case.